What's going on, everyone? My name is Kyle. Here is AKA Racer Night 99 videos in general. Welcome to another Cup Race Review. And it's time to review of the 2024 Gold Bowling at the Gwen, the second race of the round of 16 at the Roll Course at Watkins Gwen. And I just want to say a huge congratulations to the number 17 of Chris Busher. His first ever Roll Course win, first win of the season, and his sixth career win for Chris Busher. Man, I gotta say, what an intense battle for the race win on the final lap. I'm gonna talk about that later. But right now, Chris Busher for his first ever roll course win in 2024. And also his sixth career win. And now, for the first time since 2015, the Forts got the win at the Gwen. I gotta say, what a great win for Chris Buescher, grabbing his sixth career win and his first win of the 2024 season. And now let's get on to the first stage of the race. So, stage number one, not a good way to start bottling. An early caution that happened in the first lap of the race on the bus stop chicane. And then they bring us up the first caution. And then stage number one, NASCAR racing veteran Martin Shrex Jr. grabs stage one finish. At the Gwen. And then stage number two. Lab number 38. The 99 of Daniel Suarez was stuck in the sand. That brings up the another caution. And then the one of Ross Chastain wins stage number two. I gotta say for Ross Chastain starts on the pole for his second career pole in the Cup Series. He did a great fantastic job. And I thought it was going to be like a non-playoff driver, but it is right now because Chris Buescher got the win today. So, I got to say, what a great day for the non-playoff driver with the win at the Gwen with Chris Buescher with the win at the Watkins Gwen for the first ever road course win. Ross Chastain did a good job. So, yeah, I got to say, stage number two finish goes to Ross Chastain on to... The final stage of the race. Lap number 47. The number 11 of Denny Hamlin spins in turn number 2. That brings up the another caution. So, I gotta say, what a rough day for Denny Hamlin, by the way. Because he finished 23rd. But the next race he has to win is Bristol. He's gotta be the must-win situation. If Denny Hamlin gets the win next race in Bristol, he's got a chance to advance to the round of 12. So, could Denny Hamlin get the win next race in Bristol? We're about to find out. So, anyway, 11 laps to go in this race. The number 21 of Harrison Burton brought out the caution because of the tire gone flat and the tire debris was been going on. And that brings out the another caution. Seven laps to go in this race. William Byron, the defending winner, got wrecked. And, Ke and Brad Keswalski got wrecked. And turn number two, that brings up the another caution. And round two laps to go before the race was over. That Tyra Reddick in the 45 and Kyle Busch brings up the another caution and turn number two. And last but not least, guys, I want to talk about the finish, by the way. What an outstanding finish for Chris Busch here. I thought the number 16 of Shane Van Gisbergen was going to get his second career win. But I got to say... SVG did an amazing job, by the way, finishing second. I thought he was going to win. He had a fantastic race car. You probably know he's going to go to the Cup Series full-time next year for 2025 season. And SVG, Shane Van Gisbergen, got second. I got to say, he had a good race for Shane Van Gisbergen. And right now, Chris Buescher grabs the checker flag to win at the Gwen, a non-playoff driver with the win at Watkins Gwen. I gotta say, because this is the second race of the round of 16, the next race will be the final race of the round of 16. Who's going to end the next round, or who's going to get eliminated in the round of 16? We're about to find out. So anyway, and also, by the way, the, the team Hendrick Motorsports, I thought they were going to go six in a row today, but unfortunately, the winning streak has officially come to the end. So, Kyle Larson finishing 12. He had a good race. It's been a long day for Kyle Larson. But, Larson needs to win next race in Bristol because this is the next race in Bristol. This is going to be the last race of the round of 16. And also, by the way, if you probably guys know that for the NASCAR on the Infinity Series, that they're going to be going to the CW Network in Bristol. That's going to be around on Friday, by the way. So, that... Next race for the Cup Series is going to be the Saturday Night Race at Bristol Motor Speedway at the Bristol Night Race. So, let me guys know in the comments below who you think is going to win. 
who is going to win at Bristol. I'm probably sure that Danny Hamlin might have a chance to win next race because he's in the must-win situation right now because he finished 23rd. But could Danny Hamlin get to win next race? We're about to find out. So anyway... I just want to say congratulations to the number 17 of Chris Buescher. His first win of the season. First ever roll course win and his sixth career win. And yes, like I said, next race is going to be Bristol. The final race of the round of 16. Who's going to make it in the next round or who's going to get eliminated? We're about to find out. So guys, have a great day. Give a red chip. Smash that like button. Hit subscribe button. Click the bell notification turn it on. We are on the road to 4,000 subscribers. Subscribe to my second channel, Racer Night 99 a second. See you guys next time. Have a fantastic day. Give a red chip and have a great day.